All right. Well, NASA doesn't have much to say, but Tom, um, it was it was uh, when Columbia broke apart. It was already uh, much earlier in the process. The fact that we can see the shuttle. Four minutes to touchdown. Commander Pan Milroy has taken over the flight of the space shuttle Discovery, flying at 600 miles per hour at an altitude of 44,000 feet. All right, so still still at about Mach 1. The fact that uh, we can see the shuttle, she's intact, everything looks good. I think there must be an awful lot of people breathing a sigh of relief at NASA right now, right, Tom? Oh, including the people in the cockpit, John, because uh, they, they're through the peak heating. That was about 15 minutes ago. And now they're just making this airplane do what it has to do to get them all back on the ground. The shuttle right now is shaking like a bus going down a dirt road. It's uh, vibrating pretty stiffly because of the, the bumps and knobs all over the outside of this non-streamlined airplane. And I'm being told that was one of the sonic booms, Tom. Did, were you able to hear it? I did hear that crack, and that would have been the announcement to the people there at the landing runway, like Phil Keating, uh, hearing that arrival of the shuttle overhead. Yeah, Phil, uh, can you hear us? And I assume you could hear yeah. that. Oh, yeah, it was great. It was a boom, boom. Was, everybody applauded who was here because that's certainly one of the big symbolic notes of uh, audible intensity that the shuttle is really coming close. Circle. We've been watching it for the past minute up above our heads. It's doing the big sweeping, sweeping right turn now to then come in and approach this 15,000 foot long runway from the south. Northbound headwind, blue skies, everything looking great for Discovery. Yeah, let's take a listen. Less than three minutes now. George Samka continuing the flight of the Space Shuttle Discovery around the heading alignment circle. Discovery Houston on at the 90. Copy on at the 90. Two minutes to touchdown. This view from the heading. The heads up display. As Commander Pen Mulroy continuing now to fly around the hitting alignment cylinder. Houston Discovery, okay. runway in sight. Thanks. Copy, field in sight. Discovery flying at 390 miles per hour at an altitude of 11,000 feet. You. One and a half minutes to touchdown. is descending toward the runway at the correct rate and is lined up with the center of the runway, flying at 370 miles per hour at an altitude of 7,000 feet. One minute to touchdown. Discovery's descent rate is 20 times higher and 7 times steeper than a commercial airliner on the final approach. That's a great shot. Discovery's landing gear is down and locked in place. Main gear touchdown. Discovery completing its 34th mission to space and the 23rd shuttle flight to the International Space Station. Congratulations on a tremendous mission and a great landing, Pam. And we'll meet you on page 5-3 with no deltas. Copy all. 